Hey guys. What's up? How are y'all doing today? I'm going to talk about my progress with these baskets and go over them with you individually really quick. This has taken me about two hours to kind of put together for you guys. And I was getting a little bit frustrated because I was trying to figure out how to put these baskets together and what else I would need, what would fit, because I didn't want to buy too much. So doing this is really going to help me out. And I had some bubble wrap on hand, so I've been using this to stuff the baskets, which is working out so perfectly. I mean, these look like they don't look cheap at all. They look really good and so I stuffed the baskets. You see I stuffed it and then I just put some tissue paper. I chose black tissue paper for this one particularly because it is a growing uh, cooking type of basket. Oh my gosh you guys. Sorry about that. Okay so I got the these are new. I haven't shown you a haul yet, and I probably won't, but this has got, like, a different, uh, four different spices in it. I'm not really, can't remember what they are, and it's sealed, so I'm not going to open it, because I feel like she should open it, and I don't think this is going to tell you, but it's grow kit, and they're different. Put that back in there. Did I show you guys? These are new from the Dollar Tree. I just bought a ton of these. They're supposed to help you uh, stay away from germs. So with or without coronavirus, I feel like these are actually really good. Especially when flu season hits or cold season. So yes. So I got those. And everybody that I make a gift basket for is getting one of those. Ooh, I gotta show you guys. Look how cute, adorable these jars are. And inside, I wish you guys could smell it. It's homemade coffee scrub. So if you remember from my Dollar Tree haul, I hauled the ribbon. Um, this I actually had on hand from last year and I just put coffee scrub to make it look so cute. Like, adorable y'all. And I still have to buy, um, I'm going to buy some pottery plants, or not actual plants, but just some little pots that we can put put those in. And she can have her little own indoor growing for herbs, which is really great. This basket, these I've actually already had on hand. The package got destroyed. And I don't remember where they came from or what to do with them. And... Instead of getting rid of them, I'm using them as part of the Christmas basket. And since this is like a cutlery board cooking basket, because it's based around the, the bamboo that I got. And I got two cute cookbooks if you've seen in my Dollar Tree haul. There's a different one of them. So I'm going to just put some food in here and wrap it up, call it good. And those, you see, like I hauled, where'd they go? I hauled some sticky dots in my last video, or in my Dollar Tree haul, I believe. And these work so amazing. These are going to come in so good handy for making these baskets. Sorry guys, my finger keeps going over the... I'm trying, I've got a ton of stuff going on. Sorry, y'all. Okay. You see this basket? Like, there's some Epsom salt. I used the sticky dots. I was playing with them. So, I got some Epsom salt. And there's another one. And then two masks, which I'll show you in this basket. But those were two for a dollar at Dollar Tree. And I was like, ooh. That is so perfect. And then Dollar Tree had this a diffuser and i thought it would just be so good for the two spa baskets this one doesn't have um a cookbook in it like this one does because they're on keto and 
Uh, I think they have all the cookbooks for keto, so I'm just going to add a few more items to that. Oh, I don't remember. Did I tell you guys that I had bought these like a year ago on sale? And you know what? They just make really good Christmas gifts, so I'm throwing it in there. Look at this one. It's so cute, you guys. It's got little hearts all over it. Okay. So, yes, these came for two for a dollar, and I just took them out of the package. And they just work so well with this basket. So, I've got to get a few more symbolic items, and that will be all good. So, you can do really high end quality baskets on very little money and of course i did cheat a little bit because i got my fab fit fun i got cause box let me see this came from cause box and this came from cause box so i did cheat a little bit it's not all dollar tree but most of this is all dollar tree well that's amazon so i mean you guys can make some incredible stuff, and I will keep you updated on these baskets. Sorry, I did not film how I put them together, but I think once I get all the stuff for this one, I'll take it apart, put it back together. That way you guys can see the process of it. So, um, but I'm going to get off here, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye.